He throws it to Rakarius who goes to Blaney on the left side. Blaney walks in now. He's behind the Kingston net. Comes back out. Throws it through the pads of Wendell Dye. And the Oakville Blades are on the board early with a 1-0 lead. Off a goal by Kyle Blaney. Nice one. Now Zappi has got it at center for the Vs. Over the blue line to Carroll. Lots of space right circle. He shoots off the mask of Daniel Savelli. And here come the Blades the other way. A beautiful chance there for Kings. Nine unanswered shots and maybe another one coming here. As it comes to Wilhelm left circle. He shoots and scores! Oh, beautiful play by the Vs up the turnover by Oakville. It ends with Kyle Wilhelm at the left hash marks. The trusty shot as always. And he ties this one up with just under five minutes to go in the first. Again, very quickly. To the left corner, he tries to center. Bennett's got some space centering for Carius who shoots and scores. Tyler Carius, about 45 seconds into this Oakville power play, takes a beautiful centering pass, standing at the right side of the net. Quicker centering pass from the left side of the cage, and not much Wendell Vi can do there. It's 2 1 Oakville. To Nyberg right half boards. Nyberg holding on to the top of the right circle. Fed cross ice. Jam wide of the net by Wilson. Then fed back in front by Wilhelm and a pad save made by the quick Daniel Savelli. Then Dave McMullen. Kingston blue line where Mason again pokes it free. Pass to center for O'Quinn. Carrying in left wing. O'Quinn stopping. Working into the slot. He shot it wide right of the net as he was all alone. And carry through center. Stephen Hickey gaining the zone with Russell. Hickey waiting. Centering McGowan. Lots of space and he shot it wide left as he had an open short side and could not double that over. Edwards collided with Wilhelm so the Blades will carry in here. From the right circle, they try to center loose in front. All alone, McGowan centers a shot and a save made. Wendell Vi point blank, up. and Oakville takes a pen. One, two with Wilhelm. Wilson over the line, right wing stops. Centers, tip wide left by Wilhelm on the PK. O'Quinn behind the net, cannot center it. Puck is loose and Kennedy skates. Gets to the side of the net, Janet by O'Quinn. It's loose for Perfetto. He shoots and scores. Tie game with 19 seconds to go in the man advantage. Corner. Fed up to the left point, Mason winds, fires, tipped on goal, loose in the slot, batted up by Zappia, he shoots and scores! 15-29 to go in the second period, and the V's pull ahead by one. Ryan swung over to Corbett, left point, shot through traffic, tipped just wide right of the Kingston net. Wilhelm, and here comes Kyle Lysag to the left wing, streaking in his carry, his left side he winds and fires, and a save made! Wendell Vi, but holy mackerel. McMullen, he'll work around one man to the right circle. Takes a bump, then feeds across the ice. McParland shot, and it's out the sink of Brad Ryan, I think. That was a yawning case. Happened to Daniel Savelli. I would have said the same thing. As the V's turned it over at center ice, Blaney took a bump from Nyberg as he tried to gain the zone. McMullen can't clear this out, though. Bennett in front, Blaney, breakaway, works in front, turn, shoots, scores! Short-handed goal for the Oakville Blade. As Blaney lost the handle on the puck at the last second, got a shot away because there was not a man in sight to stop him from scoring on Wendell Buck. Fed to Perfetto, left point, winds, fires, save made, rebound! And Kingston scores again! With seven seconds to go, Joey Wilson does it once again. It's 4-3, Voyager. Goaltender. Pass to center, picked off by O'Quinn, carries it down the middle. Then the Blades turn it over to O'Quinn. All alone, right circle, he shoots, save made. Daniel Savelli as Kingston almost got their own shorthanded goal. But here come the Blades, steering it down to Lysag. Left tap board, skates to the left circle. Backhands it to Reve, high slot, shoots. Big save, Wendell Vi. And it comes to... Couple of these get it free at the red line. Jam free by Kennedy. He'll carry in two on one with Wilson. Kennedy shoots and he missed the net high off the end glass. How on earth did that two on one happen? Kennedy just outworked the two Blades players. Got the stick of Carroll, but Reve is back to collect behind his own net. There's that chant again. Bumped by Zappia and Nyberg's got the puck, banging it off the glass and takes a lane. Right there is Cal Cromie, turned it over to Lalonde. Right circle to Lalonde, dropped back for the trailer. Agostini who shoots and it's blocked by Cromie. Comes away to the left corner. Almost a beautiful chance there for the fourth line. Yeah, he's got a one-time though, so the defenseman was right. Carius right half boards, holding on. Carius to Reve high slot. One-time pass to the right circle. Bennett shoots and scores! Tie game! Another power play goal for the Oakville Blades. And we're knotted up at fours. Bounces to the left corner. And Blades can't clear it. Nyberg steers it back behind the net to Kennedy. Centered! Wilhelm shoots! Huge point blank save by Daniel Savelli, who holds on for a whistle. His teammates on a change. Carroll stopping right corner with some space. Fed to the trailer. McParland works into the slot, shoots, and he missed the net! 
Recon Bouncing puck though is gotten at by Mason who clears it out to center. Reve can't chase it down. Wilson's got it right. Circling shoots. Save made. Bounces up in the air and gloved out of the air by Daniel Savelli. Here comes Rinelli two on two. Rinelli left wing cuts into the high slot. Winds. Slap pass. Thompson's all alone. He shoots. What a save by Wendell Vi. And here come the V's the other way. Face out. Scramble. Loose at the right circle. One second to go. And the V's have it. We're headed to overtime. Oh boy. And look at the center for Rinelli. He gains the zone against Nyberg who fell. Rinelli's got space. He sent it for Thompson who shoots. And it was blocked by a sliding Dave McMullen. Intercepts. Plays it to the left corner. Kennedy centering. Wilson shoots. Pad save. Daniel Savelli. And it comes to Nyberg. Up top. McMullen shoots. Tipped wide. Out the other side. Zappia shoots. And the net was knocked off by the skate of Daniel Savelli. Nyberg's clearance stopped by Hickey. Right point. Skates to the high slot. Chips it over to Reve. Left point. Shot through traffic. Right on. Rebound. Jammed in. But Vi no made goal, the no save. Goal, no the goal. whistle went before the Blades. Jammed that one into the net. As a puck was clearly under the pad of Wendell Vi there. Good call by the referee with 8-12 to go in overtime. But only who is so good at faceoffs. These won the draw. Comes to the point. Edwards shoots. Tipped. Right on goal. Bouncing puck. It's on the back of Savelli. And it comes in behind the net. Stop the stick of Wilson. And to the Oakville Blue. Ryan's back to collect. Turn it over to Zappi in the slot. He shoots. And a save is made by Daniel Savelli. As Zappi could not get much up. Faceoff to Daniel Savelli. He's right in the Oakville zone. One by the V's. O'Quinn shoots and it's blocked. Kept in by McMullen, shot through traffic, tip, perfetto has got it, yeah! and shoots and scores! These win, these win, these win! Steve Perfetto, the overtime hero! Again! And Kingston can clinch on Tuesday night! Man, oh man, is Steve Perfetto clutch or what for these Kingston Voyageurs? Oh, we saw him do it in the Vaughn series in an also crucial game. And then again tonight, he comes up with two goals. Absolutely massive for the Kingston Voyagers. And what a game. And let's hear the call. And they salute the Kingston fans who made the trek down here. You still hear them. And don't try and tell me that they didn't play a big part, Alan, in this huge win for the Kingston Voyagers.